Hey! We've already gotten the game in, so, you know, you haven't quite seen what my deck does, but I, I explained it to you earlier. I think you kind of get the gist of it. And you know how Oath goes, yep. obviously. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, let's treat this like another match. So that means roll to see who goes first. Oh, I get one, I get one today. <laughs> in the actual rounds, I got, I didn't go first a single time. All right, so let's see. Um, I will, I would like to, I will keep. Nope. Nope. Oh boy, oh boy. So I'll show the hand uh, that I have going on here. Oh no, no, the screen flipped, oh yeah, yeah, screen flipped around. So uh, this is nice, gives me another look. I don't want you, <laughs> um, but this is, this is okay, and then this card. So we'll see if we get there, spoiler alert, I think we do. All right. If we do, we definitely do. All right. May I move your mat up just a teeny tiny, mat yeah, close enough. Woo. Whew. Sure. Right. <laughs> nope. All right. I would like to start off by taking a look at your hand, please. Oh, we're about to see the others. Oh, well, it's okay. You have some draw power, so that's fine, I think. Right? Alright. That's... Eh, 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 eh. I would like to go Lotus Petal, Tolarian Academy. I would like to tap Academy for one. Voltaic Key. Mm -hmm. I will pass the turn. Yes. Emerald? Yes. Preordain Pre first is probably right, just in case you can scry two, keep on top. Okay. I used to think of Serum Visions as Preordain in reverse. Now I've played so much Serum Visions that I think of Preordain as Serum Visions in reverse. Right, having a bite just to quell my stomach. Mm. Draw. Yep. Good. I have a win next turn. You've got to you've got to stop me through some counter magic, right. or actually you don't. But you know whatever. I mean you kind of do, but do it. Okay. So if you had just jammed the null rod, if you had gone land, mox, getaxian probes, see this null rod, I would have had to counter. Um, and then I, you know, depending on what else you have going on. All right. Oh, yeah, whoa, 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 what am I doing? There we go. There we go. Sorry. Let me... Revealed cards. Play field. Sorry. Make two mana. Mm -hmm. I would like to cast a soul ring. Mm -hmm. All right. Soul ring. Mm -hmm. One mana floating. 
I would like to cast Time Vault. With that one mana, I would like to untap Time Vault and take an extra turn. Mm-hmm. And do we go from here? No. All right. Oh, wait, you had another Mox. Oh, but... Yeah, um... I think the play here is you play another Mox and force me to force the Null Rod. Mm -hmm. It might, I mean, it, apparently it still would, have, would not have gotten you there, but, you know, just to make me try to do it. Unless you were pretending to hold up a, a fistful of counter magic, which is also reasonable. That's fair enough. Try to, like, bluff me into playing more slowly. Definitely fair. Round two. Fight. I love that game. All right. Would you like to be on the play? Yeah. Okay. So I promise, the deck is not normally supposed to win through <laughs> assembling the time machine. <laughs> but, you know, it's apparently what it wants to do today. Hmm, <sighs> I'm gonna keep, but it's a, it's a risky keep. We're gonna hope it gets there. So here's what the hand consists of. It's, uh... So... You two are nice. I can use this to get this, which turns on this, and lets me try to do this, or this, or this, yeah, okay, so we have a lot of means, we don't have a lot of ends yet, but I think, I hope we get there. Man. Your deck does not like you today, man. Mm -mm. How many lands does it run again? I don't re I mean... It runs the playset of Mox in, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's just not cooperating. Ooh. Oh, my back. Oh, my back. Okay. Oh, cute. Yes. Scra. Mm-hmm. On top. All right, let's ready. Yes, let's do this. Jet. Okay. Emerald. Ooh. No rod. <laughs> Suddenly, this turned into an awful. Okay, do you have a land? Oh no! Suddenly, this turned into an awful <laughs> hand for me. Okay. Spoiler alert. Uh, I don't have any lands. <laughs> <laughs> and as such, I guess I'm just gonna play this out so I don't have to discard. Past turn. You know, sure. as you do. Butch. That would be abundantly clear when I didn't play a land. <laughs> hey, Gunner. I yep. thought you left for some reason. Mm, I did. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> I left to the land of colon blockage removal. There you go. The null rod giveth and the null rod taketh. This is stony silence for every other format, Gunner, but, uh, but it's, uh, it hurts. It hurts, dog. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Well, That's a, you can't tap the Mox Emerald. Oh, I thought it was I couldn't play. No, you, you can't cast them. I mean, you can't tap them. You can cast them. Oh, okay, I get you. Go ahead. So you can't play the abilities. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But you're still in a better state than I am right now. Obviously. Uh... Yeah. Down goes Grizzlebrand. Pass turn. Good. Let me take a look at your hand, please. Eh. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. That's the way to do it. Oh, no, 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 you hardcast it. In that case, pass turn. Pretty. It resolves. I like your shirt, by the way, Gunner. Thank you. True. I'm gonna have Dropkick Murphys stuck in my head. I'm sleeping off the line. I'm flogging Molly more. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh, Jay. There you go. Hey, Sweet. take care, my friend. Yes, sir.
Oh, man. You know, I have a sneaking suspicion I'm not going to be assembling any time machines anytime soon. <laughs> Pass turn. Ancient Grudge or Mox Opal? Uh, I'm, you know what? Actually, I'm still super dead. I'm just going to let that go and keep going, keep playing. Alright. Gush. <laughs> uh, yeah, it resolves. Land for turn. Mm hmm. Ponder. <laughs> yes. I'm just being. I'm drowning in your card advantage. Man. Mm -hmm. Oh, put them back in the yard. Jesus Christ, I haven't played this format in a while. Did you accidentally preordain? No, I pondered. No, but I was acting like I was going to scry. And then oh, I was like, okay. wait, I can't do that. So I'm just going to shuffle. That'll work. <sighs> After that, um, well, you might actually be able to play whatever you get, so I'll wait. And then whatever might get me out of this, I'm sure there's a force of will waiting for it. Okay. Now I'll scoop. Yay! <laughs> yeah, I mean, you were still getting at, and then, what were the next ones? The next three off the brainstorm? Ooh, maybe I shouldn't have skipped, well, whatever. You're still gonna win this one. And then for me, yeah, Paradoxical next, Forbidden Orchard. Two more turns and I'd be able to play, actually, I did have an Ancestral. Oh, whatever, but two more. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I think that yours is better suited for the long game. We were just talking, you, you have Library of Alexandria in your deck, for instance, mm -hmm. and a library deck wants to be able to play the longer game. That's kind of how that works. All right. I would like to be on the play this time, though. All right. Ooh. <laughs> I think we're okay here. Yes, I will keep. I'll keep. Right? I would like to start off with a Gitaxian probe. Yeah. Would you like to misstep it? No. Okay. Ooh, and your own Gitaxian probe. Oh, you have no idea how good this hand is against me. You have no idea, my friend. All right. And then I'll draw. Um, I got a tiny bit better, I think. Opal? Mm hmm. City? Yep. Ooh. Pass turn. Let's, let's race to see who can get Oath Forbidden Orchard first. <laughs> You're already halfway there. Chip probe. Uh, Force, Memories Journey, mm -hmm. which is actually a, a good card in this deck. Mana Crypt, Force, Tendrils of Agony. Right. And I'll play it real, of course. Draw. Yep. There we go. Lotus. Yes. Crack Lotus for three blue? Yep, that's that's the call. Ponder. Okay, blue, blue floating. Results. Yep. We're not going to take too much longer, Margaret. This is almost over. Sure. Thank you. No problem. Forbidden Orchard. Mmm. Orchard Oath. Uh, that's not good. Tap for green. Yep. Use one of the blue floating. Yep. I have dreads. I mean, I guess I have to do it, but you kind of got me here. Wait a minute. Yeah, that didn't help. Alright. Alright. 
you actually can just fluster storm because you still have blue flooding. That, that is true. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. That makes more sense. And let's see. Uh, yeah. There's way too much storm this turn for me to pay for that. So yeah, I'm uh, technically speaking, I'm in trouble because um, where's my Craig Wesco token? Let, let me get my Craig Wesco for the the spirit that I'll be running for this <laughs> for the next second. It's not going to be much longer. All right. Go ahead. Well, I basically have to do it this turn. Basically. Spire of Industry. Mm-hmm. Which is apparently not happening. I would like to swing at you for one. Yes. Uh, all one. Ah, uh, if tendrils were grape shot, I could kill my own dude, but uh, no. That's like the one way that grape shot might be better in this spot, and that's exactly it. Yeah, I'm, uh, I lose. I think. I'll play it out just in case, but I, I do lose here. Um... Play of the crypt just in case there's a chalice on zero. Mm -hmm. Trust in the heart of the cards. Pass turn. Right. Upkeep. Upkeep. <laughs> we'll try this again at some point because my deck has not shown its potential, if you don't mind, but not not today, not tonight. Mm -hmm. If you'll be here tomorrow, we can try it then. Oh yeah, I will be. Tomorrow, if people want to, we can just play from my gauntlet. I'm okay with that. All right, so in your deck, we actually have three options we can get. So, I am a little... Hey, Muldrotha. Oh, <laughs> what's in the graveyard? <laughs> There's a Black Lotus in the graveyard. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> and a Jace. And a Jace, yeah. And a Faden. So, Black Lotus, and then play either Jace or Faden. Draw. Mm hmm. Uh, given what's going on with my deck, I strongly recommend Jace to lock me out of the game. Yeah. Crack for blue. Yeah. Add. Uh, red. Why not? I have another Craig Wesco. All right, I'm one mana away from being able to force it. So we're just gonna fate seal me. You can take a, yeah. Leave on top. Okay. I need to die. <laughs> When you leave your opponent a Black Lotus. <laughs> you know it's bad when you leave your opponent a Black Lotus. Oh, oh, you know what we forgot? I'm gonna do a die roll. If it's odd, I take damage. It's odd, so I take three. Uh, from the Mana Crypt. Mm -hmm. Oh, did you play the... Yeah, you did. That's mm -hmm. right. Um, I guess... Pass turn. Yeah. Trigger. Yes. Oh, I should have swung into... I mean, you're just gonna let it go through, but I still should have... Oh! Hit you for three. Hit me for three? Yeah. Not even oh, bothering yeah. with the token. You can hit the, the Alright. Okay, so me for three, right? Yeah. One, two, three. Draw. Black Lotus, yeah. Yeah, Black Lotus again. Black Lotus every turn. <laughs> that seems pretty strong, every permanent type. So now you can get Dak Fate, okay. Yep, and a land. So yeah. Uh. <laughs> this is so bad. So yeah, three blue. Yep. A red, get Dak. 
All right. And then blue floating, just in case we needed that. Which deck fade nimbly would you like to use? Draw two, discard two. Okay. That's fair. Give you something to do with your blue if you be named. Discard of the religion deck. Yeah. Um, Fate Seal you. There you are. Bottom. Okay. Note to self, after the game, see what that was. Use the other blue. Yep. Ancestral. I have a third Craig Wesco. It's, uh, it's actually Noble Hierarch. Come on. <laughs> what? Um, ye yeah, but you know what? You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my stand. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna force a will that time walk. <laughs> I can't say I didn't try. Alright, All right, you take your extra turn. Six. Yep. Uh, you know what? I'm. How many creatures? Okay, yeah, I've got to block here just so that you don't get the Grizzle Brand too. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna block with the Noble Hierarch because it's the one that's off. Mm -hmm. And, uh, pass turn. Because Inferno Titan Moldrotha isn't bad enough. True. Oh, um, on your upkeep, you can forbid an orchard to give me a creature and then oath trigger. That is true. It doesn't matter. It's not. Oh, God. <laughs> I think you win, though. I think. Margaret, he's so far ahead that if you just give the word, I'll concede. <laughs> I'm, I still have a couple things to do. Treasure cruise. <laughs> yeah. Well, I was hoping for better. You know, actually, you probably don't want to do the oath trigger just in case Grizzlebrand is the bottom card. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, that would be bad. Face of you. Wait, how is Jace only at three? Oh, he's uh, at nine. He's yeah, at nine. He's at okay. Nine. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you are? Uh, keep it on top. Okay. Come back. Yep. Trigger one, one, one. And then I lose, because I take 12. Yeah. Good games. Yeah. All right. All right. Paradoxical outcome, Hercules recall. Yeah. Holy sh Yeah. I... Is there a double-digit number of ways that I was <laughs> effed in that game? Because, uh, wow. When you leave your opponent's Black Lotus. <laughs> Woo! Man. So, uh, that happened. <laughs> we can try this tomorrow if you don't mind, because that was a yeah. lot of fun. Oh.